Hello everyone, welcome to this, my chapel gallery. Well, actually, it's our garage, which we converted. We've got the pipes boxed in along here, we've got the electrics done, we had it all painted white, and we used it as a music studio for a while. There was a, a piano here, there was a hi-fi, and we used to come in here and sing just so that we wouldn't annoy the neighbours or disturb them too much. Another thing that I used this space for was to have a little quiet time in the morning, just for an hour or so before the day got started. I used to come in here and be quiet and contemplate. And then it occurred to me, you know what this is like? having your own private chapel. So then I thought, well, why not do that? Why not make it into a chapel? And so as part of the East Yorkshire Open Studios, this installation was produced, and this is what you can see here. But the real inspiration for this was my interest in art, and spirituality. And about eight months ago, a friend said to me, Peter, would you do a talk on the art and the sacred for the local art society? And I said, oh, you mean art and spirituality? He said, yeah, that will be okay. Well, for many years, I've been thinking about this subject, art and spirituality, and this, this book was about 50% complete. So, in order to do the talk, I finished it off. And there are illustrations in here, there are quotations, there are slides, slides which I used in the talk. So, the key to everything that you can see here, the paintings, the boxes, the key to it all is in this book. And later on, I'll be making other videos and going into this in a little bit more detail and explaining a little bit more about what you can see here in this space. So, what we do have, let's just have a, a quick look. There are seven major paintings, which are really the key to getting everything here off the ground. And let's just have a look and see what have we got. Okay. We've got a red one, we've got an orange one, we've got a yellow one, and on this side we've got green, blue, purple, and we've got a white painting in the car as well. You can see other paintings. There are three big ones at the back here, and there are three small ones at the top, red, blue, yellow, and a couple of more on the side. Now, other things that are in here, one that you can't see, a stained glass window here. And then we've got these little altars with these boxes on them. And one of these altars has got candles. There's candles on it as well. Stained glass, candles, altars. Gives it a church like feeling. A chapel like feeling. The boxes, they're the same as the paintings colours of the rainbow. We've got red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, and a white one as well. In the boxes, there are many things that we can talk about, but perhaps to begin with I'll explain that uh, there are mini versions of some of the paintings that I've done in the past. That's a big painting. That was six foot by four foot. There are also Hero paintings. Vasily Kandinsky was one of my heroes, so there's a mini version of one of his paintings, which you find in the box. And another painting, which is especially important to me, and that's a painting by Marc Chagall. And it's got a white rainbow in it. Very interesting. So, rainbows, the colours of the rainbow, that's very much a thing. Yeah. And uh, here's another illustration. Six colours and white. 
seven colours of the rainbow. So, that's about it for now. That's just a taster, just an introduction as to what you can find in this space, in this chapel gallery. That's all for now. I'll be back later.